Hello, everyone. Awesome to have you all here today. Okay, hope you can hear me all loud and clear. So I'm Alex from View School, and uh, I want to welcome you all to Vue.js Forge. This is the first time we host such an event, and we are really excited about it. It is going to be a lot of fun. You're going to write a lot of code today and tomorrow, and hopefully you are going to learn a lot of new things. UGS Falls is a unique event, and I'm going to explain the structure so that you know what to expect during this talk. But first, I want to explain how we ended up having this unique event. As you likely know, at Vueschool, we teach developers Vue.js through video courses and tutorials. We have over 700 lessons on Vue.js, Pina, Vuex, Vid, TypeScript, ES6, and whatnot. And uh, we are popular for the Vue.js masterclass, where developers learn Vue.js by building a real-world application from scratch. And uh, when we say real world, we always mean it. So in the masterclass, you will learn how to implement user authentication, databases, and the full thing from scratch. So at your school, we believe that the best way to learn code is to write code. And that is why we have been hosting intensive workshops um, for companies and, and conferences over the last, uh, uh, and over the last two years, also in our virtual classroom. There's something weird going on with my stream, but I think it is synchronized now. Yeah? Okay. So the View School workshops are an intensive way to learn a full concept in a day instead of a month. And um, the structure of a workshop, it's like this. The workshop lasts for a full day, and it is divided in sessions. In every session, we have 10 to 20 minutes theory introduction. Then we take questions regarding uh, the theory and what we're going to build in the session. And um, then we have the hands-on exercises. I see a lot of people here in the comments, they ask if the audio is on mute. Is the audio muted or can you hear me? Okay, I'm waiting like for 10 seconds to hear. Okay, Maria says we hear you. Can other people also hear me? Okay, that is strange that so, so many people we don't have audio. Okay, awesome. Thank you very much for confirming. So I continue. Um, so then we have hands-on exercises in every workshop session, and then we live code the solution. And like to repeat it because uh, we get this pause. So we have instruction, question, hands-on exercise, and then solution in every session. And then we repeat, um, the full day until we cover the complete concept of the session. As you might get after the full workshop, your brain is fried. But the next day, not only you know how to use a tool, but you level up and you know how to use the best practices, the pitfalls to avoid, the common gotchas, and everything you need to know to utilize this property. Now, due to the nature of the workshops, we are able to host up to 50 developers in a classroom. This allows, a, this allows our instructors to pay attention and help each participant to the maximum. But as you likely know, at Vue School, we love taking care of the Vue community. So we wanted to be able to scale our workshop and host thousands of people in one class. And this is how the idea of UJS Ford started. You can think of, uh, uh, of it as if Vue School workshops and our online events, View Nation and Next Nation, had a baby. If that happened, that baby would be Vue.js Forge. Vue.js Forge is a series of live events where we build an application from scratch together as a community. It is like a hackathon, as Anurada mentioned, but it is not competitive, so we just work all together. And everybody, by participating in Vue.js uh, Vue Falls, will have a lot of fun, will write a lot of code, learn new things, 
and they hopefully make new friends. This summer in Vue.js Forge, we're going to build two applications. The first application on July 13th and 14th, today and tomorrow, is going to be a Trello clone. And uh, on August 30 and 31st, we're going to build an e-commerce app. So I will give you three seconds to put these dates in your calendar. Three, two, one. Okay, let's go. So far, the community seems to be really excited with UJS Forge. We have had over 10,000 people participating, 3.5,000 people who are coding along with us, making the Trello clone. Uh, everybody makes their own version of the application. We have 150 mentors from all over the world assisting uh, everybody with a code, troubleshooting, and giving advice. And we have thousands of people watching us from everywhere. And we have managed to make the event free for everybody in the community. This is thanks to all the amazing people, uh, you, who buy our courses at View School and support our work. And I want to thank you so much for your support. But this is also thanks to our brilliant sponsors um, that we really appreciate that they help us with all of our online events and allows us to make all of these events free for the community. In Vue.js Forge, we also have a new concept, the product sponsors, of whom we need the technology to build the actual application. Product sponsors, they provide us, of course, with a service, but also they provide us mentors who help you solve problems while you code and then block you so you can focus on your code and learn the best practices. It is important to clarify that we evaluate in depth all of the service providers that we work with and that we would not recommend using a crappy technology just because we benefit from it. All of the products that we use in Vue.js Forge are top quality and are highly vetted, tested, and recommended. And um, to clarify, Vue.js Forge is different than the regular Vue School workshops. And if you're familiar with that, you will notice the difference. That um, uh, we had to change the recipe in order to accommodate this gigantic audience. In UTS Forge, we will be building a real-world application, the Trello clone, and to make time for it, we remove the theory part from the event. So there will be no lesson taught before its coding exercises. In each session, we will start with an explanation of the exercise, what you are going to build in that part. Um, and uh, this will always be Daniel Kelly, who is the lead instructor at Vue School. And uh, we also call him the master of code at Vue.js Forge uh, because he created all of the exercises, all of the code boilerplates, and he will also help all of the live coders and the speakers with the solutions. Then after we have, the, we have explained the exercise, we will answer your questions from the audience um, in regards to what we are going to build or how we are going to build it. And then it's where the fun, like, or the most fun part starts, which is the live coding part. At this point, you will start solving the exercise on your computer, and we will have a, a person from the community solving the same exercise as you do on the stage live. So as you get, this is going to be a lot of fun because we expect to have bugs, we expect to have problems, we expect that we might need the help from the audience to achieve the exercise. And um, once we are done with that, we again repeat the same uh, process and we go to the next exercise until we have completed building the full application. Each live coding or coding session will be about 45 uh, minutes. And uh, all together, all of the speakers and the contributors uh, of UJS Forge will, uh, will be committing their results to a single repository. So after the event is complete, completed tomorrow, we will have a repository where we will hopefully we will have made a Trello clone all together. And every one of these people that you see here that are our speakers, they will have developed one feature or one part of the application. Um, so during Vue.js Forge, we will take you from your first commit to having built a functional Trello clone, hopefully. Um, we will even help you make your first open source contribution. Um, yeah, if this is your first open source contribution, 
which, which is in fact the last exercise of the event. Okay, but uh, as you like, many of you know, coding is fun, but it's even more fun when you are coding as part of a team. And a lot of you force participants have taken part in our matchmaking program, which means that they are matchmaked into teams, um, which are now placed in Discord rooms with people from the VUE community who share the same interests, are close geographically, in, uh, they are in a good variety of skill level. And this way, we make sure that they can work nicely together and solve all of the challenges that we will be uh, assigning you over these two days. The, the communication of the teams takes place in Discord. So if you don't have, uh, if you have not used your key or your token to log in into your team in Discord uh, yet, you can check in your email, find your uh, ticket, and run the command to log in. Um, and uh, once you are in, you can decide with your team if you want to work independently or if you want to delegate tasks. Um, what this means is that um, as a team, you don't need to necessarily like everybody to do the same, but this is a great way to do it. So everybody might want to develop their own application and you can discuss with your teammates uh, your approach or you can, you know, like you can see other solutions. You can share your screen to get live help from, uh, uh, from your team and have fun coding it together. So that is the one way when you work independently. And in the other way, you can delegate tasks so that you can divide the workload and you can say that some people will work, let's say on the API implementation, somebody else might work with, uh, um, you know, with, with the assets or they might do the state management, the notifications, like you can see all of the exercise and you can decide how you want to collaborate with your team. Okay, so this brings us to the conclusion that at UJS Forge, we have three types of participants. We have the people who are participating in teams, and uh, this is happening through Discord. And uh, yeah, they go together as I just explained. Then we have the solo coders, who are people who are not on Discord, and they are working on their own by themselves, and they are watching us here on Vito. They are following the same exercises, just not as part of, uh, of Discord or not part uh, of a team. And lastly, we have the audience, which is everybody who is watching us here on Vito and they didn't came here to necessarily code their own version, but they came here to watch some of the, the greatest uh, uh, people from the community live code. Uh, maybe they came here to see the Q&A with Evan Hugh or something else. But um, yeah, this is the third type of, uh, of audience, people who enjoy the, watching the conference and not coding. Even though, um, yeah, even though we put like a lot of effort to make sure the event is fun for everybody. So no matter if you're in a team, if you're coding solo, or if you're part of the audience, like uh, we, um, we believe you're going to have a lot of fun during these two days, but we highly recommend that you join the event as part of a team so that you can meet some new people from the VUE community. You can make some new friends. Like this is a nice uh, opportunity for you. Uh, to, to socialize with some people who you share the same passion for Vue.js. Okay, and as a side note, um, everybody who participates in coding the Vue.js Folds application is going to receive a certificate of participation uh, in a week uh, or two after the event. Great, let's talk quickly about the mentors. In Vue.js Forge, we have 150 awesome people from all over the world who will be assisting you with your code and the issues that you face. So thank you very much, mentors. We really appreciate your help in this. Um, let me explain you how the mentorship works. First of all, you, in Discord, like all of, all of the mentorship takes place in Discord. So even if you are just coding by yourself, we recommend that you join Discord to access the mentors. And um, in, in Discord, we do have this category Vue.js Forge Mentorship. And then you can speak with, uh, with mentors from the service providers like uh, uh, 8Base, Pattern CMS, et cetera. Um, and then you can ask your questions or get help 
for any specific problems we have with these services. So if you need help implementing uh, a component from TweakPix, you can speak with people from Twix, TweakPix directly uh, there. And um, we also have the colored mentors who uh, will be helping out all of the teams based on their color. Every team has a name which is a combination of a color and an animal, like for example, like a blue iguana. And this makes you like a blue participant and then you would go to get help from the blue mentors. So for example, if you're a blue iguana, you will go to ask for help in the blue mentors. If you are a red panda, then you will ask for help in the red mentors. Okay. And before we get started, I want to mention that if you would like to experience the original View School workshop experience, we are hosting a workshop on the View 3 Composition API with Daniel Kelly next week. And um, typically the price of the workshop is $500 per person, but we're hosting a raffle where we give away 200 free tickets. So if you are interested, you can find the workshop on the Vue.js Forge website, and you can sign up for a chance to win a free ticket. And um, all of the companies who have signed up for Vue.js Forge will have a guaranteed access uh, ticket for this uh, Vue School workshop. We also have other uh, workshops uh, from our partners on some awesome topics that uh, we will be using in the application that we'll be, uh, we will build today. They are all, uh, these workshops are all free to sign up. Um, so if you're interested to learn how to optimize your asset performance, uh, how to use uh, headless CMS, server functions, or some other concepts like that, um, we offer 600 free seats on a first come, first serve basis. So yeah, if you're interested, uh, grab your seat quickly. We just released these pages uh, today so that we give all of the live uh, audience the chance to reserve their tickets uh, first before we announce it to the rest of the View School community. Okay, so now it's about time to get started. For everyone who is watching as part of a team, open your Discord and join your teammates in your team channel. We will take 10 minutes for you to meet your team. So take a moment to introduce yourself, Say where you, uh, where you are joining from, what is your job, your favorite hobby, and what you are looking to get from participating in VGS Forge. And uh, we will be back soon with the first exercise and uh, more instructions and information about the event will be provided during the day from uh, our amazing MCs and uh, our master of code, Daniel Kelly. So thank you so much for joining us and uh, for all your support. Stay awesome and enjoy the conference.